Hi guys and welcome back to my channel, Just A Mum Winging It. You are joining us today for part three of our unboxing um, or unpackaging, unwrapping, whatever you wish to call it. So if you've seen my previous two videos, you will have seen the clay and the speedy 25 in the monogram that I picked up. So we're going to unpackage the last one. Now this is the one, it's a big one. <laughs> that I accidentally opened, but I've not um, taken it out of the bag, as you can see. I just cut it and I was like, oh no, that's not what I think it is. So, let's just jump straight on it. Okay, so, let's open it. Now this, in fact, before I start, this was um, something I wouldn't normally buy and I wanted to try it out, so I didn't buy the most expensive. I went for sort of a medium range. They had cheaper ones and they had more expensive ones, but I wanted to go for just more of the lower end, because I don't know if I'm gonna use it or not. It's something different for me. Um, and it's more just for storage as well. So, anyway, let me stop rambling, and let's open it up. So, it's Louis Vuitton again. <laughs> as you probably guessed when you saw the dust bag. Um, so this is just off the bat, a really cheap brown looking dust bag. Let's open this up. There we go. Um, this came really quick as well. I think it took about 10 days, super quick. And like I say, it wasn't that expensive. So I'm not expecting fabulous quality but I'm expecting better than some crappy ones you can get so the um, it's not level as you can see it's a printed on a wonk and it's just that really cheap I could almost probably push my finger through kind of just bag but it's come with a dust bag for the price that I paid I didn't think it was going to come with anything so the fact it has got a dust bag is a bonus let's open it up and see what we have so we have a laptop bag we've got a laptop case um like i say it's not something that i would normally use um but i need somewhere to store my laptop and my accessories and the charger so I thought I will try one of these and if I like it I might invest in something a little bit more um, but this is just going to get chucked on the floor and things just thrown in it so I didn't want to spend too much and it sort of get ruined so um, the canvas does actually feel really quite nice actually that's nice these are really shiny gold and quite cheapy feeling sound feeling um, the hardware the little um, buttons do say Louis Vuitton on them um, that D ring doesn't and neither does that one let's take this off so the glazing on this is not bad it's a bit wibbly wobbly and the stitching is not fantastic either look as you can see there's a couple of um, like loops there but they probably just want a bit of a snip just to tidy them up um, it's not too bad the glazing it's just not fab but that's where this is where the price comes in this is what I'm saying it's just you know this is mediocre um, quality and they feel quite thin as well, but I don't actually know what the original ones would feel like because I've never seen one. Let's take this bit off as well. <laughs> I love whoop, off. Um, and yeah, there's a bit of wrinkling. Can you see wrinkling increasing? But it's on the inside. Oh no, actually, you can see a bit there. I wonder if I might be able to smooth that out a little. Um, Okay, the canvas is up the right way round on both, and on the sides and the bottom, it's just little patterns. Oh, I can feel something rattling around inside. Um, 
they don't say, the handles here don't say Louis Vuitton on them either. Um, but it's not bad, it's okay, it'll do what I need it to do. It's just gonna, you know, they're definitely pleather and not leather and quite thin. Um, if you can see the knot, it's not thick and it's, well it's definitely plastic. I don't know why I smell everything, you can smell leather though. <laughs> So let's open it up. Oh, the zip was nice. Let me do that again. I didn't. I didn't sort of notice that. Oh, now it's getting stuck. Yeah, it does work okay. It's just because it's it's a little bit squished. Um. So. Oh. Oh, guys, look. It's come with a luggage tag. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. Oh, that's cute. So you can hang that off of there. Oh, sweet so a little um, luggage tag and it's come with a oh what <gasps> guys we've got another padlock and key yay so <laughs> this padlock feels completely different to the other one let's see if it works oh it works I didn't think the key was gonna go in for a second then um, Let's do that again. Yeah! <laughs> it works! God, I wasn't expecting that. And a strap. Let me put that dust move down there. And a strap. So let's have a quick look at the inside. So it's nice and big. It's not, oh yeah, it's not fab. It was cheap, guys. It was cheap. So it's, there's a couple of little of like unfinished off strings here. That that's fine. I will trim them off. That's not gonna, you know, it doesn't affect it in any way. Um, so you've got like a mobile phone pocket here, um, which I don't know what kind of phone that fits. I'd probably just put some pens in there, and it's just one big hole. Um, and then you've got your Louis Vuitton Paris made in France stamp there. Um, there is no date code that I can see and then you've just got a little pouch there and the zip works yeah zips eh, it's okay and then you've got a strap which oh that's cute so you've not got normal original um, lobster clasps they're slightly different and they're quite thin, but the actual fabric on this feels really nice and it says Louis Vuitton on it. So let's clip it, let's clip it on. Oh, this is good for um, carrying if you take it out and about, which I don't take my laptop out with me. I just need somewhere to keep it at home, keep the dust off it and keep it clean and tidy and safe. Um, so, here we go, if you want to hold it, you can get your arm through, pop it in there, there's a close up of the inside. The canvas does feel nice though guys, there's a bit of hair there, and let's try it on, there's the strap up, up closer, <laughs> and let's try it on, so let me loosen that up a little bit. So I'm 5'4", and it fits, fits nicely. It's gonna keep, oh, that's annoying, flapping. Um, I wonder if you've got it, oh, a crossbody, it's not bad. But you've gotta think, once so you've got all your gear in there and it's zipped up, it's probably not gonna be too bad either. Um, but like I say, for me, I'm not going, oh, that's like printed into the fabric as well. Um, I'm not gonna be taking it out and about anyway. I just wanted somewhere to keep it safe at home. Um, and my tablet and things, my iPad and yeah. So there we have it. I'm impressed that it came with a strap. I wasn't expecting a strap, the little luggage tag or the padlock. I was just thought I was getting, I just thought I'd ordered the laptop case. That's it. I didn't think I was getting any of these extras. So that is a nice little added bonus. Let's pop padlock on here because like I say I do like um, 
Oh, look, how cute she. Let's pop the key inside the zipper pocket so we don't lose it. And let's pop this on as well. The little luggage tag. Pop that on this one. Stitching's nice guys, it's nice and straight. It's just it's just that the handle, like the stitching there's not great, but the actual stitching on the bag's nice. And the the piping's not too bad either, that's quite nice. It's just the handle really that lets it down. It feels thin and flimsy. Um and um it's a shame that it's not sort of like there, if you can see like finished off this. It's okay though, and just like here, there's a bit of um, use of fabric there that's not been just not been finished. But like I say, that's that's because it's cheap. It was it was not expensive. I think it was twenty eight pounds. It wasn't much at, at all. Um, I will leave the price that I paid for it in the description down below because I've not got my phone on me and I can't remember offhand. But it was no more than thirty English pounds anyway. I can tell you that for now. So yeah, so there we have it. Um, the strap, that and that was a nice added extra, which like I say, I was not expecting. Um, and it will do exactly what I need it to do. So it's not bad for the price and it'll just look cute under my office desk. Like, ooh, look at your little Louis laptop case. Yeah, so there we have it guys. So that is the last of um, this unboxing part three sort of little series this is the last one have I got anything else coming in um, I don't think we do I think everything has now been delivered um, so that's it for now um, let's pop that back in the just bag Go. at least it fits and it came with a dust bag as well for 30 pounds you can't grumble so yeah um yeah this is the last one i've not got anything else coming in i think everything has now been delivered so we're doing all right so that's it guys enough rambling from me you're probably sick of seeing me so hit the subscribe button if you haven't already or if you're new here welcome and don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up because we all like a good replica video and um, leave me a comment down below guys if there's anything else you want to see if you want to know who I bought this from like I say it is a DH gate purchase um, so if you want the seller's details leave me a comment and I will do my best to link them if the store is still available sometimes they disappear your order and they disappear so I will do my best if you are wanting that information comment and let me know and I will get back to you and we will see you in the next video have a look at my previous video guys like I said there's a couple more unboxings there's a speedy 30 on there there's a what's in my bag ham um what's in my bag video um and I've changed from my other speedy 25 into the 30 so we're doing a swap over as well um, what else have we got going on we have got our daily vlogs don't forget to check them out cleaning motivation videos have a look at those all sorts on this channel it's a bit of a family channel replica channel luxury items fake luxury items in my case um bit of everything on there so and also our christmas so decorate with us for christmas the kids are here the hub is here um and it's just a nice december video so happy second of december that's when we filmed it and we will see you in the next one, guys. Have an amazing day. Love you all. Bye now. See ya.